Animation Master uses decals and materials to texture modeled shapes. Decals are bitmap images, typically created in a paint program. In the Project Workspace, right-click on the Images folder, choose Import Image, and navigate to an image to add to a project. Drag the image from the Images folder into an open model window, position it over the model, then right-click and choose Apply. Decals are typically projected straight onto the model surface from the current viewpoint. This is known as planar application. Temporarily flattening a mesh is a powerful technique to make better use of planar application, but for many shapes, other projections may be simpler. For example, rather than attempt to flatten this simple lathed shape to match a bitmap image, we can select a front view in the model window, drag in the image, position it over the model, then choose an application method of cylindrical before applying. This automatically wraps the decal around the model. Decals can alter the surface appearance in many ways besides color. This image, applied to the model as a bump map, creates the illusion of surface elevation based on the gray value of its pixels. Changing the map type to Displacement creates actual elevation with correct perspective and shadowing. This image, applied and set for specular intensity, limits the specular highlight effect. If that same image were set as a transparency map, see-through effects would be rendered, again controlled by the gray value of the image. Working together, the color displacement, and specular maps create the complex appearance of an old-fashioned barrel on a very simple mesh. Animation Master Materials work without bitmap images. Right-click on the Materials folder and choose New Material. By default, a material has one attribute that defines basic surface qualities. For example, a plastic look can be made by choosing a diffuse color of intense red and setting the specular highlight to be white, small, and bright. A rubber material might use a diffuse color of dull gray and a white highlight that is very broad but also very dim. Clear materials will add the transparency setting and typically refraction, which creates the familiar distortion effect of glass. Materials are dragged and dropped onto a model to texture it. Unlike color decals, materials must be rendered to see their full effect. Materials can also be dragged onto named groups in a model to texture them individually. Materials can be saved separately and imported into other projects to be reused on other models. A material attribute can be changed to a combiner of two attributes. This simple checker combiner uses a white attribute and a blue attribute to fill alternate areas. Combiners can even be nested within other combiners to build up complex effects. This cork material uses a turbulence combiner to create dark spots within a light background, which is then nested within a geometric pattern combiner that imitates the characteristic growth rings of wood. Unlike bitmap decals, Materials have infinite resolution and infinite size. Materials are also the starting point for cloth, particles, and hair. Animation Master decals and materials are powerful tools for creating detailed-looking models without needing to model every detail. <laughs>